also figured out hallways are for loading. The generator room for this sector is ahead. The game is loading when you're in hallways, so that's why they're not just to look pretty. It's actually like in Half-Life when you walk Hey, around. look at it this way. The worst that can happen is that you fail miserably. When you walk around corners in hallways when it was loading, only that we can now actually stream stuff. Without a loading screen. Fantastic, you made it. If you can get to the generator, I'll tell you what to do. Sure. It's the most easy. Uh oh, shit. For your general health and safety, I would recommend disabling those. The switches for the laser beams should be up there. Somewhere. Yeah. Wow, gee, thanks. Okay, run, 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 run. So where the hell are those switches? Okay, so we're gonna need a sofa or something to block but just move it a bit more fine i'll take it like this for your general health and safety yes, i would yes, recommend yes, you already told though. me that shut the fuck the up switches for the laser beams should be up there somewhere okay so where the hell are those switches or more. Oh shit! Okay. Why am I moving forward? Is that a slope? No, this is not a slope. Oh god. Back down. Okay, I can't actually get over there. Oh, are you kidding me? <sighs> okay. Much quieter. Yes, and not so hectic. I'm trying to solve puzzles here, not. It was so safe where that was, though. I'm trying to solve puzzles here, not fear for my life. So, what is over there that I have to. Nothing at all. So why is this fan here then? Oh my god. You'll have to bridge the gap somehow since the scaffolding collapsed. What? Why is it? That doesn't make any sense. You see that? That makes more sense. Why is it getting sucked down? Also, how the hell do I get over there? This doesn't happen since it's get all getting blown over here. I can't stack stuff because... Oh. Oh. I see. I'm supposed to stack it against the ground here. Ok, 
Okay. Here goes nothing. Geronimo! Yeah. Oh, I hate this. I'm probably gonna have to start from here. Why can't they just allow auto uh, saving? Why doesn't this have a save function? This is so terrible. I know I'm complaining a lot about this game, yet you'll have to bridge the gap somehow since the scaffolding collapsed. So I guess it's kind of okay, but you can see that it was built with console in mind, which isn't helping a lot when you're playing on a PC. Like that autosave feature, it's telling you don't turn off your computer when this autosave symbol is appearing. In my, I mean, who the hell just turns off a computer while you're playing a game? Nobody does that. You only do that on consoles. There we go. Checkpoint. Okay, it looks as if the motor has stopped. You'll need to get that arm rotating fast enough to reactivate the generator. I guess I'm gonna need a box from here. And put that on there. No, I... Why can I... You know what, fuck. That reminds me of the time when the DC voltage was offset by the CW multiplier. One down, two to go. That doesn't seem terribly safe. <laughs> Are we actually... Holy fucking shit, we're actually... <laughs> yes! Yes! Holy shit, yes! We're actually back at the mansion. We actually finished an actual chapter in the game. Or an act, or whatever you want to call it. Holy shit. We've done it. We've actually done it. So this is... I don't even remember what this sector of the mansion was. I can't get through that door, which is weird. I guess I have to go this door. That wasn't so bad, was it? Oh, why don't you take a look at those blueprints? Shut up, guy. Shut up. Right. So what was it? Blue wing. What's the heart? What does the heart mean? That I never died? Yeah, I guess so. So. I got all the collectibles, apparently. I died a couple of times, but fuck that. I'm not trying that again. Also, I'm not trying to accomplish all these goals there. I mean, that's insane. 83 minutes. Oh my god. Wait, it did, it did say collectibles there, yeah. Overall, 8 out of... There we go, blue wing, 8 out of 8. Yeah, that's good with me, as long as we've got the collectibles. There's that crazy blueprint room. Ah, oh, splendid. It seems as if the power is starting to come back online. As I still haven't been able to figure out how to get out of here, you'll have to make it to the next generator. You can access the next wing of the manor and the power grid sector by heading up the stairs there. Okay. So... 
that was the blue wing down there. This is yellow, I guess. This is the portrait room of a dashingly handsome young man. USS Gorilla. That is my second cousin, Billy. He's always been enamored with the fiction found between the covers of a book. He decided to model his life on his favorite stories. No one saw him after this particular plot line. What was that book called? Oh, oh my god, I should know this. Uh, Moby Dick, right? And yours as Gorilla? Was that the ship, ship in the... I'm not really sure if that, that is the ship from... No. It's probably something way more classy in the book. It's probably a reference to some of the people who made this game? I don't know. So, tell me about this. Come on. Or is it just all Billy? No. That's an older guy, so... Who's this? Come on. Fine, don't tell me. Tim. Fisher Michelson, oh. one of the initial major investors in Quadrangle Industries. I'm hesitant to admit it, but many of my grander inventions would not have been possible without his support. Right. So who is this? Is this this guy? Well, I guess so. Why is it just telling me stuff about some of the paintings? Not all of them. I guess it is Quadrangle Manor a long time ago. And this is just a painting. No, I'm not going in there yet. Fuck off. I've been waiting a long time to come back here without ruining my progress. Is this the second floor? Has education these days deteriorated that badly? What? No, I'm looking at paintings. Fuck you. Papa Quad. Oh, from Quadrangle. Moon Unit Zalpha. Zeta Alpha. Quad. So we actually have a... Oh, he's holding Sputnik. That's nice. I don't know what to make of all this. Oh my god, it's every single one of these going to take over an hour. Well, 60, 70, 80. One and a half hours, so... Uh, I guess the red room is not actually... It's just bonus levels, so I guess that's one and a half hours. Another half, one and a half hours. That's three... Four and a half... Well, it's not actually that long. So this would be the last, I guess. Last one to go to. So... I guess it's... Up and onwards! 